started producing when I started college and I guess I've always wanted to try to make music because I remember even earlier than that, maybe in high school, I tried downloading like Pro Tools, not Pro Tools, what was it? Reason, something like that. But I couldn't get into it because I couldn't figure it out. YouTube had not really existed yet, so I couldn't have tutorials. I mean, so I mean, I've always had an interest. I guess it's because, you know, when you play the piano and stuff, and when you really like music in general, you kind of, at least for me, you kind of want to be able to make it. Essentially, when you make music, you're making the kind of music you want to listen to. Producing in LA was really great because everyone was very open-minded, so if you just made a normal beat, no one really cared. It's when you made something more experimental, more different, more interesting, that um, people really enjoyed your stuff, so it was a nice environment to be around, and I guess that kind of blossomed into the kind of music I make now, which is like kind of hip-hop influenced and soul influenced, but also very electronic. Flying Lotus started this label, small label, so he could showcase these people in LA. And um, obviously he's, with his um, own reputation growing, everyone on the label also has their reputation growing. And with the rise of EDM, as in like specifically electronic dance music, you just have an overall rise in electronic music. So when you have people interested in dance music, you always have people that don't want to listen to the dance stuff, they want to listen to, um, I guess, what we provide. So we offer like a different, facet of what electronic music can be. I always try to remind myself to like, you know, stay cool, stay humble, stay, remain like a reasonable person. Cause, I don't know, I guess as you know, everything is growing and becoming larger, the scale of music is changing, how people listen to music is changing. You know, you, there's only so many things about yourself that you can really keep, keep consistent. With this next album, I, I don't want to gain more fame from it, though I do wish more people would be able to listen to the music and uh, work with more vocalists and, you know, help produce for other people and continue my own stuff and, yeah, continue touring. Even though it's a drag sometimes, it really makes your life more interesting. <laughs>